Hello and welcome to the start of my January haul. I have my SPC mystery kit for January, which I'm just going to flip through really fast because I will have my monthly review video in collaboration with Gabrielle of Gabrielle Plans going more in depth with this. But I mostly have this order to show you from Valerie's Papery, so I'm going to start there. So this order, like I said, is from Valerie's Papery and so cute. I was so excited that she reopened her shop for winter break. She is off at university, so she closed her shop, but she brought it back. And I love her handwriting. It's just gorgeous. And then I wrote her a little nice, a little note in the notes to sell her. So here is my order. I clearly already went into it, but such cute packaging. And even on her envelope, the little handmade with love stickers, so cute all the extra touches so um she did have a little sale for opening back up um and I just got a few things but I got some like staples <laughs> so this is her freebie and it's in her matte paper so she has matte paper and clear um paper and it's like a clear matte paper if that makes sense too I believe her shop will go back off um, or will be closed again once she goes back to school, but I have a feeling, maybe, I'm not sure. Valerie, maybe you can answer this in the comment section if you're watching, because um, I know sometimes she does. She might reopen maybe this summer, like another break. So, just giving you a rundown. This is her adorable freebie. I love how usable all these scripts are. Then this is an extra freebie, and it's like a shop swap from Pancake Bunny Co. Those are really cute scripts. And then here is my order. So I got a couple things and then I did get two oop sheets because I think that was part of her like weekend sale. So mostly I came for more school scripts. These are my favorite like script school. They're bold, they're the perfect size. So I had to stock up and I got three sheets of them because I just wasn't sure when she would reopen. Then I got this adorable sleep in and I like the combo of the block and a little bit of the script. It's the perfect size and I ran out of sleep in script so picked some up from her. Then I got this script which says work which is funny because I mark my work with school um, since I'm a teacher but I wanted to do this when I'm like working on Etsy orders or at my Etsy shop or something like that so. I did work but I also did order some customs from Carly Plans that say like my shop name but I thought this would be cute too. Then for oops I got these two so I got the matte paper in Starbucks which hallelujah so excited for these. I really wanted the clear in Starbucks but she was sold out so I am really glad that I got the matte. And then this is May which is cute. I don't like, I think this is mostly for bullet journaling, um, but I will still find a way to use it. I'm sure. Um, I don't, I see maybe like a little miscut down at the bottom, but still completely usable. And same with this. Um, like the cut line's a little close to the script here, but still completely usable so I am really happy about that let's see if I can get that on might just go back in my reusable sticker album so thank you Valerie so nice love your shop and I'm so glad you reopened for winter break <laughs> okay next up let me quickly go over the January mystery now this is a spoiler in case you haven't seen it however I know Andrea puts her reveal videos up like the end of December and this is now the end of January maybe even early February so you've probably seen it by now so if you need to skip ahead a little bit here's your chance otherwise three two one all right yep this is the right way so this is the January mystery this is my last mystery subscription from SPC at least for now I did already rip the solo open <laughs> um so I wanted to make sure I stayed subscribed until the January, the famous January birthday kit. It's been like an amazing birthday kit for the past couple years and I was feeling some FOMO, wanted a cute birthday kit 
or like a celebratory kit so stayed on till january and i don't know i'll talk about it more in my reaction video i'm gonna film that next but let me just do a flip through it's like a neutral very neutral <laughs> birthday but i do like that it could be used for bridal baby graduation birthday bachelorette like i feel like it could be used for a lot of different things so that is nice bottom washi's pretty lots of fashion people like bam lots of fashion people too many fashion people in my personal opinion but that's that's fine and then it did come with these two extras which is really nice and it's in the matte bronze which i think was the corresponding foil bundle and they're just birthday overlays and then some birthday doodles so cute you can see my reaction video to that for more in depth but that was the flip through of that so that is this first little section and i'll catch you in the next section all right i'm back with another section please do not mind my horrific nails i like don't like when people comment on it but this is like this is so cringe it's so bad i'm going to do it but i need to finish this like painting project after um i film this so i'm gonna do my nails after that painting project but i really wanted to film this haul so i can put away the stickers okay long story long let's get into it i have three orders one from fruity sticker co Clan Hannah and um, Carly Plants. So let's start with the one and only Carly Plans. Love that she writes Jen Joy. So sweet. Her daughter's little name is Joy. So just has a special place. Um, oops. I have to cover this up. I have a scratch to win card that I'll just show you. They're super cute. That was part of her New Year's Eve sale and I already scratched it and got my code and I wanna honor that and not give that away. But this was two orders placed in the same sale weekend and I asked her to combine the orders because yeah, I just forgot. So this is my initial order and then I'll go to my second order. But again, this was all from her New Year's sale. Um, yeah, so I got Maria's freebie so cute it was so hard deciding which um like PR girl but I do love Maria I'm literally in the middle of watching her haul right now and have it paused <laughs> so that's kind of funny and ironic but love her freebie great sample then this is the December freebie Carly's just always so generous with her freebies and then the 15 plus so I picked up Etsy in the heart and she came out with these. Oh, my nails are so bad. Okay, sorry. Um, She came out with these for all like social media kind of thing. And since I just started my Etsy shop, I thought this would be perfect. And I got it in assorted. Of course, you know me, I got to get my backpacks of the color of the month. So this was the blue colorway for December. Then I got ear pods. I have her like original, like... Oh, let's see if I can grab it here. From when she first opened her shop. Um, on a moment, let's try to find it. They're like the AirPods. There we go. I only have a few left. So this is what I have been using. But as you can see, I'm running really low. And I just thought that these, like the colored ones with the AirPod case are so cute. So I'm excited for that. Then I got the YouTube in the heart in the color of the month because I feel like blue is just like one of those shades where for the assorted, you only really get two different versions and I wanted kind of that navy and different. Yeah, it's one that goes fast in this sort of colorway. Okay, this is so stinking cute. This is the list and I feel like this is so cute to mark when I make my grocery list or like when I make my grocery order. Um... So I'm really excited about that or just like to do time. Like I do have a functional off camera, like to do list planner. And if I like marked that, I don't know so much. Speaking of grocery orders, got the grocery order script. And I think this is font two. Hello months and four seasons. So cute. 
And I love that it's stacked of the two different fonts. And then I got a repurchase of the podcast because I like to pair it together when I listen to, I listen to at least one podcast a week. I want to get into some more, but I'm not sure at the moment what to get into. If you have any recommendations, let me know, but I will give you a warning. This is like, I know I'm an outsider. I don't like true crime. So no true crime <laughs> recommendations. Okay, and then I realized I missed missed some things, and then it became January 1st, so then the January colorway came into play, so, you know, two for one. This is January's freebie now. So cute, Valentine's Day, kind of self-care centered. The colorway for January is these adorable pink backpacks, so you can see, like, in the past she's done various, like, color combinations, but the past for December and for January she stuck with one color and kind of like faded it and gave the array of colors and I love that because pink is another one of those like for the assorted um and red that you just need like more shades of it then I got YouTube binge because I just finished my script sheet of YouTube binge so I needed some more then I got a custom with my shop. It says Shop Savy Joy, and I love it. And then this was the thing that really set me over that I needed was holidays. I realized that I don't have, like, I started my holiday sampler at the beginning of last year, and now it's a new year, and I don't have any. So I need to automatically put MLK Day straight in my planner for this week. So there we go. That was my order from Carly. Next up is Plana Hannah, and I actually won a giveaway on her Facebook. It was one that um, her friend kind of like gifted. It was super sweet. If you're not part of the Plana Hannah Facebook group, I highly recommend. Great place to be. Super cute journaling card. Um, but shout out to Mick Plans, Michelle, because you got to like nominate somebody else, and she nominated me, and I of course nominated her back which I would have done and um that's how I won so I got some credit and then I used some of my own but I knew right away I wanted to pick up two sets of foil bundles I got this light purple there we go kind of in night sky and I actually am using this for my current week let's see if I can pull it up that was really loud Oh, I just placed all the boxes over, so it's a little hard to tell, but um, it's really cute. And I have a light purple foil that I'll be using in the springtime. Actually, I'm not sure. I might use it in February. That's why I wanted to get it now, so I had the bougie boxes ready to go. So that goes with that. And then I wanted another of the hot pink in night sky because I do have a spread in February coming up really quick that I'm using hot pink foil and I realized I did not get the hot pink underlays. Then I decided to get two sets of quote boxes and like if you watch my videos you know I'm not a huge Disney person or like princess obsessed but I did get princess one and two, one in gold and one in silver because there are often times especially with some of these older kits that I'll be using kind of through the spring um, and I have a couple coming up that I just have one of those like older SPC pattern boxes because I really need the box count. I need a part of my boxes, but I really want to put a quote over it and I don't have a lot of quotes and I like the idea of just having like a set in gold and a set in silver to just pull on when I need it. So I didn't get obviously all the colorways, but I think this will kind of coast me for those kind of times where I need it. So I got Princess 1 in gold and Princess 2 in silver. So might try to see if I can pull in this Olaf or Anna quote or Elsa. They're all in silver, so maybe I could pull it in for um, my spreads in January. I'll have to look into that. But I think um, I do have a Moana kit that I'll be using, and I think I'll try to use gold foil. So that will work. I can pull that in. So yeah, they won't necessarily match princess kits. Then the last two things I got, oh, I of course got the freebie. And this 
says, I don't know about you, but I'm feeling 22, which is really cute. And it also made me like, I know that it's 2022 and that's what it's supposed to go with. But it made me realize how old this song is and how old I am. Because I was like, oh, like, I don't, I, I'm already past New Year's. I'll just use it for birthday. And I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm 27. <clears throat> like, that's not that old, but that's so far off. Like, I don't have 22 year old friends. <laughs> I'm not 22 myself. Um, so... I think I might have to go back and add it or just keep it as like a random quote. So I don't know. <laughs> Reality check. Anyways, then I got the date dots in font five. I really needed to restock on some black date dots. And of course, this is the best font. And I love how bold it is and the kiss cut. And then I got Starbucks because, of course, much needed always. Okay. That's it for Planet Hannah. Next up is the Fruity Sticker Co. And if you don't already know, I do PR for the Fruity Sticker Co. And they're on a break until the end of the month. So they might be open by the time this haul goes up. But I'm pulling out my invoice because I'm kind of seeing things that I did not get. But that's okay. That's always good. Like, not in a bad way. So this is the super cute journaling card. Love it. Um... I said APR, I don't think I said my code, you can use Gen15 for 15% off. And here is my cute freebie. I love it. Okay, so what I got, here are these, okay, 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 let me focus here. Okay, she was doing grab bags. So I got two sets of grab bags, and it's funny, one came in a cello and one did not. I don't care, but just something to note. Um, again, I don't know why I've noted it, but I'm noting it. I got the stars and discs, uh, or discs and stars. That's what it was. Grab bag because it's cute colorway that goes, you know, got some blues, got some pinks, got some grays. And then my favorite colorway, which is the colorway of my freebie, which is soft sunflower. So I got two grab bags. So you were promised 10 sheets. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, okay. Um, for five dollars. So this is what I got. Again, it's totally random. So cute headers. Disney, which I won't use, but I'm gonna put it in my D stash. Facebook, which I won't use, but that's okay. I will definitely use these. Instagram, that's really cute. That's kind of cute. Those could be used for even like check boxes. Hmm. Diamonds. Probably won't use those. Little TV, but I always feel like it's like Mickey ears on top. So maybe I'd use those. Dividers. These are great for monthlies. Cute bows and moons. So that's a really cute variety. I'm happy with that. Then the soft sunflower. Got the diamonds again, I see. Okay, cute. These are just like the little string lights. Oh, happy mail. That's super cute. Checklist. I'll use that. Oh, cute. That's like, I use the highlight sticker, but these are good for just like dividers. These are good dividers too. Little flags, paper clips. Love those. Grocery cards. Cute. And Facebook, which I won't use, but that's okay. Overall, out of those like 20 sheets, I would say I would use most of those. So I am happy with that. Then this is what I ordered. I ordered a PP Weeks kit in the Discs in Stars. And I think this colorway is just really pretty. So I wanted to pull it in possibly in January. But if not, like, I don't know. Could be cute February, March, like April. Oh, this would be really cute for April. But I'll probably use it sooner just because it's cute and you can use it anytime. Then I picked up some scripts and random stuff. So I got new releases read arts and crafts snuggles really needed those organized desk post office needed that the instagram in pastel the cute um, pillows in pastel and then oh sweet another grocery order so that's exciting and then these were the like freebie add-ons so thank you Brittany. i don't know if you watched this but this is really exciting so I don't remember if that was like part of it. I ordered this mid-December. So yeah, I don't honestly remember. Cute little, maybe these are misfits. I don't know. 
I don't know. Okay. Um, date covers. These are really cute. Love that. Oh, I just finished my monthly with this. This is the peppermint colorway, but that's okay. Super cute. These would also be cute for gift tags for next year for Christmas. I used a lot of free sticker co stickers for gift tags. Oh, cute little checklists. Okay. I can stop saying cute little hexagons. Love that for layering. Somebody's a freebie. That's, that's really useful. Ooh, these like night star boxes. That's fun. Some more teardrops, more Mickeys, which I won't use. And then my favorite kit on her shop site. I used this last year. It was adorable. It's, I don't even know what it's called because it's not a regular collection, which is really sad because I love this colorway. But it, um, it's really cute. I was going to show you what it looks like in action. Okay, it would help if I could find it. There we go, let me zoom you out here. So fun, right? Love it. Plus I had the perfect uh, check boxes, which really made it. So that is it for the section of the haul. Hopefully I won't have too much more because remember this is a low spend, but these were New Year's Eve. Well, that was pretty much a giveaway. This was a quick, or my Carly Plan stuff that was sale and then this stuff was from december so that doesn't we're not even counting that right okay i will probably see you for one last clip all right of course i forgot um to show you what i got from black magic melts so i'm gonna quickly go through it i always love their bubble mailer and they're always so kind to include a sample and this is almond joy and i opened it up and I don't, i've never had an almond joy i think it's coconut though because that's what I'm getting I'm not sure so I'll try it out because it's always worth trying but not sure if it's something I'll purchase but I love their festive bag colors so I did pick up three and um these were I think they were doing a new year's eve sale as well that's what it was um so I got caramel cookie pretty self-explanatory smells really good and really sweet because you got like obviously double combo of sweet then I got this one, which is part of their Christmas vacation, and I love that that's like the the background of the label as well. And it's one year membership to the Jelly of the Month Club, and it smells like raspberry jam because I realized I didn't have any like berry scents, and I really wanted to try that out. And of course, gotta support Christmas vacation because I love that movie. And then I got almond biscotti and this was one that I actually messaged Carly because there was two, I think it was like almond macaron and then almond biscotti and I was like, okay, help, which one smells the best? And she was so sweet. She went and like did a smell test and compared them both and, um, not the best, but for like what I wanted, I definitely wanted a more like sweeter bakery scent. And she said that this one would fit my vibe more, so Shout out to her. It smells delicious. All of them do. I am really excited to um, change out my wax melts. I got an order, what was that, in the fall, like late fall, that I've been going through. And yeah, I'm just really enjoying my wax warmer. So that is it. On to the next clip. All right, I am wrapping up my january haul and this is the last thing that i have to show you it is a buy sell trade from some friends co order and i already kind of flipped through it so she packaged it a little bit nicer but this was the august 2020 mystery and i passed on this and it has been in my mind to get for so long and i've gone back and forth back and forth and i'll tell you why um but let's I'll tell you why in a second. These full boxes just are stunning. I really, 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 I know we're gonna go on a trip in um, like do a road trip with friends over the summer and possibly one time in the spring, but I really wanna do a spring break one to Arizona and like do the Grand Canyon and maybe a couple other things. So I am hoping I can use that for spring, this kit for spring break, but if not, it will be used over the summer and it'll just be really cute. I'm obsessed with olive green. I also love burgundy, so the combo is just fabulous. I love the touches of orange because that's also my favorite color, and the blue sky is really pretty as well. 
this kit originally came with copper foil which i have plenty of so i didn't need it and the person wasn't selling it so worked out perfect so this is an ultimate kit which and that was something that originally i was like nope the mini kit isn't worth it um however i realized i still really want this kit and the ultimate kit is what makes it this van is adorable outfits adorable so here's my hang up this color right here is my hang up i love the other colors i even love the tan but this it like there is nothing to it and it just drowns it out these full boxes are gorgeous like i would love a light blue or even another shade of like brown would do or or like i don't know anything a gray like even if they pulled in that gray i don't know oh that gray actually would look really cool okay anyways this white that was my hang up for so long so yeah um however gabrielle of gabrielle plants who you probably heard me talk about i'm just gonna keep flipping she used this kit back in the fall and she color blocked it and i was like "Ooh, okay i can work with this i can color block <gasps> Oh my gosh that dog so cute okay sorry squirrel um i always get so sidetracked color blocking that is how i'm going to make this kit work so i definitely needed an ultimate for that reason it came with the label sampler which helps a ton it also came with the bottom washi which is just like i'm gonna cut it in half right there with the copper foil so cute and then it even came with the extra boxes and glitter headers so and the old school journaling card which normally i don't like journaling cards but this is pretty so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna color block it i'm going to possibly take out the white color altogether because again waste of a color in my personal opinion so i'm gonna double up on the other three colors and then i might look and i might try to pull in that blue or maybe even a gray if worse comes to worse, I'll stick with the white, but it will be on, what would that be, Thursday, so it's just the, like, one day a week. Anyways, that is my plan, and hopefully you will see in a future kit lineup, but I'm really excited to finally make that happen. So hopefully you enjoyed my January haul. It wasn't too long, wasn't too short, just right, in my personal opinion. <laughs> so thank you so much for watching. So sorry for my gross finger. I promise it's not like actively bleeding. Okay, TMI. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye everyone.